Hi guys, so welcome back to today's channel or today's video on this channel. Um welcome back. I've not seen anyone in ages, not been doing anything in ages if I'm honest with you. Because of yours truly not been great. My headaches have been stupid and I couldn't even look at my phone most days. That's why I've been so inactive on Instagram as well, just because my headaches have taken over my body. It's been awful. Um, so thanks everyone for the patience. And it's just like a little catch up on how is everyone doing. Um, Reese's car is up for sale. He's had a few people look at it. So that may be going very soon as well, which is another thing. <laughs> um, but today's video is basically for Valentine's Day, for Christmas, for birthdays. It's what... It's what to buy a car enthusiast. I get a lot of um, Instagram messages of females asking about their boyfriends, what they should get them. And I'm always like a bit, hmm, I don't know. I just buy Reese things that I know he likes. So it's just a bit, so it's just a video really, just like explaining loads of different things that you could get for them. I'm just trying to help you all out guys. I am. So, I'll start with that in a moment. Um, anything else? I have a video coming up. Well, I'm going to get it up like as soon as possible because it needs to be up before all my other videos. Of what else is being done to my car. Um, I have all the parts at home. So I just video everything that's, that I've got. And then link everything below. And then we can get the videos up on how I've done it and how I've fitted them. And yeah, so that'll be great. Um, so yeah, back to, back to gifts for guys or girls, car enthusiasts, not car girls, not car lads, so yeah, let's go for it. So I'm going to say, I think I have 10 or 11, but we'll start at the bottom and then we'll like head up. Yeah, so I'm going to do from like the, the boring present. Um, right, so the most boring thing that I do have on my list is a keychain. This is going to sound really weird, but if you're a real car enthusiast, you would love a little keychain with your car or the car make or model on it. Because I do. I have a little Fiesta keychain, which I think is really cute, and it's just like my Fiesta, so it looks great. So I, I'm happy with that, and I think if someone should give a little gift, a little box, a little keychain, even personalised, I think that's a really great gift and it's really nice. That's a little one. Um, next, I have up, obviously, my whole, when I first got my car, everything I did to it was lights. And interior especially, I think, LED dash interiors, I do think we need to, if they've got a really boring interior on the car, I think we should lighten them up. So, you need to go and buy him some bulbs. Or you need some football bulbs. A little headlight bulb. So, little things like that, it's a bit nice. So, yeah, so that's a little thing. I've got the whole set. Reese got the whole set in his car. I um, can't remember what colour mine are now. I think they just changed the colour. Because I changed them like three years ago now. Hmm. I think they, they, well, they were red, weren't they? Because that was standard. And then that is changed colour. Um, the next up I have, um, I got car mats, not your normal bogs on the car mats, like decent ones for the weather and they can like to spray it off if they get muddy. So like, I'm not sure if you had the snow recently like I have last week, my car mats ooh, are horrible but Reese has the weather resistant ones and well I think that's what they call them. And they're great, all you do is just swallow them down and that's fine. So, yeah, so car mats are a real good one. Um, but obviously the WeatherTech ones, I think they're called. Yes, yeah, so keep your eye out for that. Um, for them, because I do think that is a big thing. And if you're anything like me, I never clean my car mats. So, yeah, <laughs> that's a very good one. Especially for me. Hint, hint. Um, some look little, but some are very useful, and some that everyone needs in the car. Uh, a dual car charger, so like a USB that can fit two or three in. Um, yeah, so in I have one, Reese has one, 
and we're both charging our phones at the same time but i think this is like major because i feel like everyone needs a phone charger in the car and if you've got your friends they're always like oh can i charge her and you're like no my phone's on one percent but really you're like <laughs> But you've got to give me a charger. So a dual USB charger is amazing. And I think that would be great for a gift. Especially if you're one of the people who are like, oh, I'll buy one next time. But you never buy one. So yeah, that's a good gift. Um, I recently got a gift from a company. And it's an OBD reader. So I think an OBD reader, a mobile one, Bluetooth one, is great. Because you never know when you may need it. Like a few weeks ago, my engine light came on nothing nothing major at all it was a stupid check um plugged it in obviously told me straight away what the problem was and i am not one of them normally i'm normally someone who would like ring up my boyfriend and be like you need to help me my engine lights come on but no this time i use my brain plugged it in and it told me exactly i just put the error code into google and it told me what it was so i think an obd reader is great especially if you've got like a modified car because engine lights come on quite a lot, don't they? Well, actually, it's my first time in three years, but... <laughs> um, I think just, like, apparel for, like, your car kind of thing. Say if you want a Mustang or a Focus ST or a Subaru. Just, like, little things like that. If, if I think if you're a real car enthusiast, you should have, like, a T-shirt or a hat or a beanie or some sunglasses or anything with like your car kind of thing on um i have a hoodie with my own car on because i'm a bit um blonde yeah and i like my car um so i get that made for me but i think that's really nice i do think like stuff like that is really nice like a t-shirt with your own car on or even like the ford brand if you're really that into ford you can get like a ford t-shirt and these are only suggestions guys you don't generally have to go and do them um Something little that really should have been at the bottom of my list, I probably should have said. Um, like minor decals, so like stickers, your vinyl stuff. I think that's great. Like even a sunstrip, you can order a sunstrip. If you need a sunstrip, you can get a sunstrip. Um, but like the odd like Instagram name stickers or even your car stickers. Stuff like that are groups and clubs. I think that's really good. I only have like a couple of stickers on my car because I'm not really that fussed on like stickering it up. But yeah, some people are interested in old stickers and some people aren't. It's like white deers over there, they keep like seeing them. Um, another little thing is like your air fresheners. I have some out right now, guys, in five flavours. So vanilla, apple, very berry, strawberry and mint. So there's five flavours, I'll also link them below. I don't really like said anything about them, but there's loads available. So please go ahead and buy one for me. Um, uh, another thing that I I should have really said with the OBD reader really it's more like mechanical dash cams I think we should all if you don't have like one already in your car installed I think dash cams are a major thing I know like the proper ones can be a bit expensive but you can buy them from like 15 20 quid on Amazon so this is not an Amazon ad <laughs> um, but I think like I don't have one, um, but I have like, extra security and stuff like that. But I do think I should get one because the amount of people who pull out on me at the moment as well, like since being pregnant, the amount of people who are actually like trying to cause a crash with me, I'm like, do you know who I am? Um, but I'm like, oh, stop. So I am going to buy myself dash cam, I think, front and back. But I think that's a very good gift. Um, cleaning sets. Can't go wrong with cleaning sets. I actually got my um, boyfriend this just gone, the Blue Goblin Car Care Christmas box, that's what you used to call it, um, and stuff like that. And I do think like little boxes of cleaning products is great. Like I love the Ads Car Care, um, because Race Car Box, that's an amazing example. That is a one-off gift that you can buy them. It's got different things in. And it's like a little like cute box, that's good. Um, last but not least, I always, always buy a Reese's every birthday, Christmas, um, just to add to his toolbox tools. So I think this year I actually bought him like a, a movable toolbox with some tools. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, I always, I always do try and add on to his toolbox. So 
tools is a big one especially if you got a car because i've got my own toolbox in the back of my car at all times and i've needed it more never recently so i think toolbox for girls and boys is definite yeah you, you always need one in your car even if it's not even for your car even if it's like your door fell off at home or something you just never know so there are my um I think there's 10 things, my top 10 or top 11 um, things of what to buy a car enthusiast because I know I struggle all the time, Reese 100% struggles with me and I do, I, I think we all struggle so it's just a little helping hand but yeah so I am going to become more active, I've got more videos to come, also me and Reese looking to review some cars we have a lot of emails to get back to but if you haven't emailed already regarding your car and you can travel to Lancashire or you already live in Lancashire, please email your car with photos and obviously a brief description of it to thatfezgalx at outlook.com and um, please send it ASAP because we're going to get them in and book them all in for weekends. We have a few coming up this weekend and the next weekend I think we've booked some just with just gone. So, at the moment we're just focusing on our own cars, this week will just be pure videos on my own car and be doing stuff to it. Um, a service is due soon as well so I will be doing that. And then, yeah, so I'm back guys and I've missed you all and I'm so glad that you watched this video. Quick update, um, but I'm going to be active on Instagram now. And I'm sorry that I left you all in the dust. So my Instagram, my social, all my social medias are that first girl at so please follow me, like, comment and also subscribe and I'll see you all soon with a new video. Thank you. Mm -hmm.